Sometimes I look at my screen and I mean, even I'm just shocked at how blind I am. It's content with Kevin. He's gonna start his own YouTube channel, guys. No, he doesn't have time for that. Kevin's recommendations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What the barbecue? Mm -hmm. This summer, I'll learn how to barbecue. Barbecue. It's not that hard. It's just, it just honestly, it just takes. You just have to pay attention. Do you trust me? This is the one with the cheese. No fire, right? On this. I'm a sucker for a good liquor bag. Mm -hmm. What color I don't have enough of? Blue. Evening loves. Today was such a good Tuesday. Hold on. You probably can't even see me. One second. Ooh, this mosquito bite though. That's the only thing I'm allergic to. And when it blows up, it blows up. Sometimes it leaves a blemish too. Anywho, I'm gonna plan for a little bit. I just had my shower after my yoga and ab sesh. So it's been a super productive day, which is why I haven't checked with you guys until now. We had a staff lunch, dim sum day. It was really good. Haven't had dim sum in a minute. Then it was a lot of work, work, work. And after work, that's when I came and checked in with you guys at Mango, but I didn't end up buying those pans. They looked kind of cheap, cheap, cheap. So I skipped on that, although those earrings, I might just go back tomorrow during my lunch break. Those are really pretty. I'm not really in the business of buying fake gold. I mean, I'd rather buy something that if the apocalypse comes, I can be like, hey, take these, let me cross the board. I don't know why I think this way. You know, I just take things to the next level for absolutely no reason. Anyway, like I said, I'm gonna do a little bit of planning. I don't even know why I bought this agenda this year because I knew from January that I couldn't see what I write. Not only is my writing trash, but I can't see. So for me, it's the action of writing that helps me memorize and then hopefully remember what I need to do for the next day, like budgeting or getting a loofah or a shower puff. Which one do you call it? Either way, I got a couple things that I got on my list for today and tomorrow, because you know I need to place the Amazon order I've been saying I was gonna place a month ago. The days just run away from me, and I go through phases. Are you the same? Where you're just buy, 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 add to cart, and then you go through a phase where it's just like crickets, crickets. I've done really well this year. If you saw any of my vlogs last year, packages on packages, but priorities have changed. I'm gonna plan for a little bit and then I'm going to edit a lot because I really want this vlog to be up tomorrow and seeing as it's at 56 minutes and it's 4K, I'm figuring it's gonna take about 10 hours to render. Ooh, should I just make it 1080p? Should I cut out another 20 minutes? I mean, it was three hours and 20 minutes to start, so I've done pretty good. Oh, my skin feels so nice. What I did end up buying, I feel like I'm all, the, all over the place with this because I haven't talked to you guys today. What I did end up buying were three body washes from Victoria's Secret. They're having a sale, which reminded me of the days that I used to work there at that location. So many things have closed since the pan began. It's kind of sad. Not just for the big corporations, but a lot of small spots that I used to love going to. And even some places I showed you don't exist anymore. It's 
Is it the same thing in your city or is that just in the six? But let me not just go on a whole nother tangent. I'm <laughs> gonna plan a little bit more and then I'm gonna get to editing, but I wanted to check in before I wrapped up the day because I felt how rude. I just came in and started talking to you guys about my hair being poofy and my outfit of the day and then these pants that I was contemplating. Yeah, your girl's random. Groceries. Another day, another donut. Decided to wear this dress today that you might have seen in the last vlog. I changed the undergarment so it shouldn't be so see through. Okay. Show you what's going on in our city. This street's gonna be closed for five years. Yep, we were there. Five years. I don't know how big this cursor is. Sometimes I look at my screen and I mean, even I'm just shocked at how blind I am. <laughs> Good morning, happy Thursday. It's a really a happy one. I just finished a call for work. I started around hour and a half early. Where the bird catches the worm, I realized in order to stay ahead, you have to get ahead. So when I was on the phone, I said, thank you, thank you. And they said, you're welcome, you're welcome. And I was like, eh, where are they walking me? Am I that annoying morning person? But I figured, you know what, I always want to be the nicest to the people that do the jobs I would never do. Call center, never that. You couldn't pay me 250 k Same way I wouldn't go in the submarine, you couldn't pay me. I have so much respect for anyone that does those type of jobs. There's a lot of jobs where I'm just like, you have to be so strong to do them because you don't get enough respect when you do them on top of doing them. So anywho, segue to, I really like this top. But I don't know if it's worth 70 Canadian dollars for a t-shirt. It's not even nice material. Like this one, at least I can rationalize because this fabric, Aloe did that. And luckily this time around, there's no holes in the sleeves other than the hole that's meant to be. If you saw the vlog a couple weeks ago, maybe even a couple months ago at this point, when I first bought this top, I was so excited. I already have it in white. But when I tried it on, I'm like, hola, hola, hola. There's like this tiny hole. And with this type of material, it's like pantyhose. Once you start, God help you, you can't stop. And I bet you anything, when I returned it, they put it back on the floor. Hopefully Allie has quality assurance and they don't do that. There's very few companies that won't do that. When I worked at Zara for years, just to go on a quick tangent while I tie this up, I remember that we would put things back on the floor and then we would sell them on sale. Like we'd have a box of things that were missing buttons or had a hole because we knew people would buy them on sale and I always thought that was weird. And then there's the other end of the spectrum, like Louis Vuitton, I remember watching a doc where they said, you have to put in like a hundred or a thousand hours of just doing one part of the box, much less the whole box before you were allowed to make that initial signature trunk. That to me is the epitome of luxury and intentionality. I'm not even into Louis Vuitton. I don't think I would ever have a bag. I did like the checkered one back back in the day, if you know, you know, but. It's never really been my brand, but that credit is due where credit is due. This, I don't think is a look, so I'm probably gonna send this one back. I also got it in white, which I didn't try on for you guys yesterday, because I was, I had too much going on. The vlog that I set to upload yesterday at 7.30 still said 80% when I came home at 6.30, and it still says processing 24 hours later. It's not up, so. I know the Madrid Lisbon vlog was already four weeks late, but now it's two days late on top of that because it just won't, it's the longest video I've ever made to date. And this is a record for how long it's taken something to upload. So that's how you know. Anyway. Oh my gosh. The door is jammed. This is why you shouldn't use an inside door for balcony. This scene of the vlog is brought to you by dried fruit, my newest obsession. You know, every time I get this, I almost eat half the bag. It's so bad, but it's so good. At least it's not chips, but still, I'm sure too much of anything is not a good thing. Sorry, the vlog is gonna be boring right now. Do I even need to say it? <laughs> See you guys tomorrow. When you're working and homeboy drops down like Spider-Man to clean your windows.
For some reason, I seem to be losing my voice, but we're here at Craft, Chris's Choice. What up? And I've never been here before, but I like it way better than his first recommendation, which I have been before, which shall not be named. So anyway. That's my first recommendation. Hendrick. I thought I said Grass Rail. That place doesn't even exist anymore. Yeah, it does. No? Don't argue with me about strip clubs, buddy. I know more than you. You know, one time I went into the... That's my area of expertise, right? You can talk about fashion and stuff, but when it comes to strip clubs, I think I'm the pro. I know you don't waste money there anyway. Yeah, I Are just... you gonna buy Drake's poetry book and make the... Drake is a poetry book? Yeah. yeah. What's his poems about? The title is called Titles Ruin Everything. It's right up your alley. Really? No, probably not. Drake has enough money. I'm not supporting that because it costs a lot of money to get it started. He's not broke anymore. Rich. Oh, you know it's really good, but it's kind of small. What? It's called the uh, left field. For the sight squad, if you were blind tomorrow, I'd f cry. I'd f die. I would. Like, not know what to do with myself for the first little while. Sir, my channel is PG. What's with the app? Sorry? Yeah, I would be f dead. But I would find a way. Curl yourself up in the fetal position, or you can pick yourself up and you can do something. I feel like my hair is super frizzy, but I just want to let you know I just need to report that although we had a low key night, the shoe still broke. I still can't believe this happened last night. Not this strap breaking and the other one completely falling out. But you know what? These shoes have done a lot for me. I was laughing so hard when it happened because it couldn't have been a better time. At least it wasn't like I went all the way downtown. We were like three minutes away from home, if that. So uh, normally I'd be like, what the heck? But I just laughed at it because I... I literally told myself before I left home to go through my closet and find all the shoes that I don't need anymore. Donate the really high, high heels because I'm too scared to wear those with my vision loss. And there's a couple pieces of clothes and I'm like, you know what, you're probably never gonna wear these again. So if that's not a sign, then I don't know what is, but happy Saturday guys. It is also happy Canada day. And I'm so happy that man did not get the memo because the forecast said it was going to be torrential thunderstorms and as you can probably tell it's sunny inside and a couple of friends called me downtown and they're like oh my gosh it's beautiful it's a perfect day in the six i got a lot of work to do so i don't know how much adventuring i'm going to do with you i do have my bikini well it's not my bikini but my swimsuit from zara on so i might pop by the pool for a little bit in a bit i gotta edit first so we'll see how much i can get done I just made a peach mango pineapple smoothie. It's really, really good. I should have put protein powder in it, but I didn't do as much as I should have done for my yoga workout this morning. So didn't really need to add that. But today is one of those days where it could be rest and relaxation or it could get hectic real quick. It just depends on how productive I am for the first bit of it. So we'll see. Oh, and because I didn't even explain yesterday to you guys. So what had happened was Whenever we have a long weekend, they send a memo and they say, if you finish your work, you can log off early. That never happens for me. One of the execs said, hey, you know, happy Canada Day, two hours early as like a sign to like log off. But I still had some more work to do, so I worked for an extra hour. Then I messaged Chris, because I haven't seen him since my trip, and we met up and I caught him up on my life and he caught me up on his. It's always a good vibe. Then he had to go to a family dinner. So I still wanted to be out and about. about so that's how, I got out to hanging out with Kevin at the end of the night and went back to the place that I brought you guys to a couple months ago. I didn't want to show you the show, but if you've seen the vlog with like the flame throwing dancing chick, you know what that vibe is. I just didn't want to record it again since the last time I did, I got copyright claimed. So we just sat on the patio for a little bit and then came home and I slept. I also napped, which I never do. I never, never nap, but I was so exhausted after editing for more than 16 hours that my body just like, so that's what happened. That's catching you guys up. To <laughs> Sorry, I didn't explain in between. Sometimes my life gets so go, 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 go that I forget to go slow and be like, hey, this is my outfit of the day, or hey, this is where we're going, or hey, this is why the scene has changed. <laughs> so sorry about that, guys, but 
I'm gonna sip on my smoothie, edit a little bit, and I'll catch up with you guys when I do something more fun than that. Break from editing, and the pool right now is so tempting, but it also looks like it's about to rain, and I mean, maybe the forecast is catching up to us after all. Say hi, Eugene. Welcome. You're enjoying Woo yourself too much with that. Listen. You can't see nothing. I mean, you can only see Kevin because he's so tall. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love the camera. I mean, I wasn't even... I wasn't even doing anything. I was recording. <laughs> I'm so excited for this. I was actually thinking of roti earlier today. You were? Yeah, because I haven't had it in so long. I have, they have the goat inside. No. So this is a different way. I didn't have goat, but I made curry and shrimp and white fish. Ooh. And I broke my roti up and I dipped it in my gravy. And I ate it the other way. Ah, I see. Would you like another croissant with some meat? No? Do you have enough lighting there? Yeah. Okay. How was the tea? It's good. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Hours. Yes, hours. it's one hour long. So if it's too long, let me know. <laughs> but it's an hour long. That's a coin, apple salmon. Oh, they have a lot of these rolls. A lot of options. Yeah. Then they have sashimi. on me because I haven't been for the past few days I mean it was fun to be sociable don't get me wrong I've been living here for six years and that was maybe the second time that I was mixy by the barbecue and it was actually cool I met a couple awesome people and I probably will do a patreon video about something that I learned that I think everyone can use in their lives but anyways let me not go on a tangent because it's late I got home about an hour and a half ago I've been trying to edit this video, but I'm so distracted. You know when you're just not in the mood, but I have to. This video, first of all, videos plural. If I were to show you over here, okay, I can't see it, but I know it says, bring, 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 bring. <laughs> I've got videos from February. So it's not that I haven't created content over the last six months, because now we're into the seventh month of the year. It is that I haven't given myself the right time to create content and craft and edit the way I would like. So I was hoping that I'd be more productive this weekend. It's Sunday night, but thank God Monday, tomorrow I'll have off. So I'll do laundry and I'll probably edit a lot. I want to get this video up and done before I go to bed tonight. I was supposed to do it yesterday. I was only supposed to go to the barbecue for two hours, seven hours later, and I'm way too exhausted and lit for this. So <laughs> now we're gonna get to it. The only thing that sucks is I did it so long ago that I accidentally deleted the mic audio. So now you just get the really bad camera audio. Woo. So hopefully when you guys watch this one and you listen to it, you don't come for me. Just know that I've had so much going on in the first half of the year that I haven't been able to do what I needed to do for YouTube, but I just hope... Well, I hope the vlog that was an hour long makes up for the not so good quality because that's not the only video that's missing audio. So. Anyway, I just wanted to check in with you guys and wrap you up for the night. And I hope that going forward with the vlogs, I give myself enough time 
to stop and say what I want to do before I go out and go and do these things. I need to really ground myself. I did a 45 minute yoga class that kicked my butt. Like when I say, it's probably nasty to say, but I'll share it with you anyways. I was drenched after. That's when you know you have a good sash because I don't sweat. So I had to go curly. I mean, I should have gone curly from yesterday when it was raining on and off, but I was fighting it. But after that sweat sesh, literally, I said, we are starting over and I'm going curly. Plus, I miss my curls. I really do miss them, but I don't wear them often anymore. That's another story for another day, but I'm going to wrap it up here and see you guys, hopefully in the AM. That green tea tonight was so good. It was super nutty. Oh. So good, so good, so good. Morning, Anyways. happy Monday. I've never had Monday off before after a long weekend, so I feel so good. I figured since it's a new month, we're halfway done 2023. It's all about productivity, okay? Going forward, well, even today, I plan to do everything I didn't do this weekend. So I'm gonna finish editing the video you saw me doing last night. I'm gonna make a smoothie too, because I'm really craving one. I've got a lot of cooking and baking to do. So many eggs and I don't want them to go bad. So we got a lot and I wanted to go out for coffee with a friend, but I don't know if I have time for that. I know this week is going to go by in a whirlwind. Anytime a long weekend happens, the week at work, you won't see me. So I don't even know if I should end the vlog today and give myself a couple days of a break. But what I do know is I love the feel and smell of fresh laundry. It's the most comforting thing of life. Now, why is this smoothie warm? Frozen banana, lychee juice, I didn't put pineapple, but I put chai or whatever the s'more is. That same one I always forget to tell you guys. And there's something else in there. I think it's just strawberry banana and s'mores, which is so weird. It doesn't taste bad, it's just warm. I wanted to put spinach in it, but it went bad. See what I'm telling you about having to use up everything in my fridge in the next couple days? I don't like letting food go. It is a big, you ask for large. I want you to taste it and see. I think you're gonna still prefer Istanbul Cafe. I don't know, but we'll see. Put these all away. Some are gonna get frozen, some are gonna get refrigerated, and some are gonna be stored on top of the fridge to be given away tomorrow. I'm glad the day went the way it did. I went out for coffee with my neighbor who doesn't like to be in the vlogs. You'll notice that sometimes you only see arms, that's why. And he's so adorable. He was asking me for dating advice. I'm like, you're coming to me? How am I supposed to know how to help you find love? I can't even see it coming. Luckily, I'm working from home tomorrow because it's a US holiday, but I'll still be working. And if you know anything, I think I already told you guys today when I was doing laundry, the week is short, but it is intense. So I'll catch you guys. I wanna say the AM, but I might even see you tomorrow night because it's about to be treacherous. I already know.